Hello viewers, my name is Nur Fatah Shafika and I am a student from SMK Punca Alam 3. Today is a very fantastic day, isn't it? On this fantastic day, I want to talk about my favourite storybook. This is the book right here. This book has around 471 pages. The genre of this series is fantasy fiction and adventure. It sure does has a lot of adventure in this series. This series consists of three main characters. Harry Potter, Ronald Weasley and Hermione Granger. Now, let me tell you a little bit details about these characters. Harry Potter. Harry Potter is an orphan. His parents were killed years ago when he was still an infant by a dark evil wizard Lord Voldemort. Harry is now living with his only alive relatives, the Dursleys. Hermione Granger. Hermione Granger is a Muggle-born witch. Wait, what does Muggle-born mean? Muggle-borns or Muggles stands for known magic folks, meaning that if you are a Muggle, you can't do magic, you can't study magic, and you can't enter the wizarding world. Ronald Weasley Ronald Weasley, preferred to be called as Ron, came from a very poor family. His father works for the Ministry of Magic. Ministry of Magic. Mr. Arthur is very, very interested in muggles. He talks about muggles all the time. Now, let's not waste any more second and dive right into the plot. At, this start, at the start of this series, Harry accidentally inflates Aunt March. Wait, Shafika, who is Aunt March? Aunt March is Uncle Venom's sister. Honestly, for me, she is not even related to Harry Potter, but he was told to call her aunt out of respect. Aunt March insulted both of Harry's deceased parent, James and Lily Potter. Raged, Harry then inflates her. Honestly, I will be mad too if someone were to insult my parent. Harry then packed up his stuff and prefers to spend the rest of his summer at Leaky Cotton Inn in London. When the night bus crashes into the darkness and halts in front of Harry, it's gonna be a no doubt for me that it is another far from ordinary year at Hogwarts for Harry Potter. Upon his arrival at the Leaky Cauldron Inn, Ministry of Magic Cornelius Fudge warns him about Sirius Black. Who is Sirius Black? Sirius Black is a mass murderer and a former follower of Lord Voldemort. Oh my god, it is said that Sirius Black is after Harry. That is perhaps the most terrifying fact for me. Back at Hogwarts, in Harry's first ever divination class, Professor Trelawney sees an omen of death in Harry tea leaves. Isn't that crazy? <sighs> Harry then sneaks into Hogsmeade, a small town near Hogwarts, and there he overhears a conversation in which he learns that Sirius Black was and still is his godfather. That is very shocking. This series has a lot of lessons and moral lessons for me. It brings me joy and comfort when reading this book. Do you, don't you want to figure out what Harry feels or what Harry does when he found out that Sirius Black, the mass murderer and a follower, a follower of Lord Voldemort, is his godfather? Don't you want to figure out? I suggest you reading this book. That's all for my review for today. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye and have a great day.